Hey, hello guys. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can install Cursor AI Code Editor on your Android phone. Yes, you heard right. We can use Cursor AI Code Editor on our Android phone. So let's do it and let's learn how you can do that. Okay. So first of all, you need to install Ubuntu OS on your Android phone. Don't worry. It is free and without root, you can use it you can get that video link in my video description so watch that video and first install ubuntu 24.04 on your android phone using termux okay after that you can easily access this type of desktop of your ubuntu operating system so ubuntu it is also a linux distribution so you can use it you can also use kali linux if you want okay so in this video we are using ubuntu and in this ubuntu we are going to install cursor ai code editor okay because we cannot install directly on our android phone so first open way any web browser and type cursor ai mahesh technicals okay in the google after that you will get this article which is from maheshtechnicals.com so just open this article okay you can see how to install cursor ai editor on android phone so you can see this image and this is my article so if you not found this article don't worry go to meshtechnicals.com and search here cursor and press search okay now you will get this article so just click on that article here i'll provided all the instructions how you can install cursor AI. Yeah, so just follow this guide okay so let me show you so first option is first you need to install ubuntu or Kali linux on your android phone via termux so we have already ubuntu installed so if you not install you can follow this guide okay now let's log into our ubuntu operating system we already logged in using ubuntu command after that you need to update your packages so just copy this command go to termux and make sure you are in the ubuntu mode okay otherwise it will not work so just paste this command here and press enter and it will start updating your ubuntu packages so it will take some time so let's wait okay so now our packages are successfully installed now the next step is to install wget package so just copy this command this package help you to download files from internet using your terminal okay so very useful package so now after that package installation we need to download our cursor ai code editor installer script so this script will automatically install cursor ai editor on your android phone okay so first we need to download the script so just copy that command and paste enter then let me check type ls and you can see cursor.sh file is successfully downloaded okay now we need to give executable permissions to that file so for that just copy this command and go to your terminal and paste enter paste and enter and you can see now let me show you ls and you can see now this file is in green color it means executable permissions are granted now we need to run that script so to run that script just copy this command and paste here and press enter now you can see this script is open now in here you can see we have a lot of options install and install update and more other options so for installation you can type one and press enter now it will automatically download latest version of cursor ai code editor to your android phone and it will automatically install it on your ubuntu operating system without any issue okay so it will take some time i'm fast forwarding this video because you have we have to take less time okay so just wait until the process complete now you can see our task is complete successfully it means cursor ai code editor is successfully installed in my ubuntu os so now let me check just open your vnc viewer and you can see now go to go here and search for cursor so let me check now you can see we have cursor icon here just click on it and click on add to desktop now you can see we have shortcut here now click 
on execute here and it will open our cursor ai code editor it will take some time if you are using first time okay so after that it will work properly now you can see cursor ai code editor it's properly working on our android phone now click on login and don't click again and again just click on login at one time okay guys it will open your web browser so it will take some time so wait until it's open web browser and you are website so wait here okay after login you can easily use cursor ai code editor without any problem now you can see login page is here i am going to use google login so continue with google i already logged in my google account in my browser so it will directly identify that and it is asking for yes i'm logging now login successful now close the browser and you can see our login page is gone now it is asking for vs code import so we're not going to use that so just skip that part then use any theme whatever you want so i'm going to i'm go with this and let's continue then privacy mode then continue then again continue that's it now we have our cursor open now click on open folder let me create one project for that just go to desktop now let me create folder here so just click on folder icon and type demo you can type anything but i am going to use demo to demonstrate you so we are already in demo folder now click on open here that's it we have open our demo folder in our cursor code editor okay we don't have any files now you can see the here are the all the models which is available cloud 3.7 also available now you can see this all options are available this composer is available if you not see this composer let me show you how you can again open that just click on this icon which is side on setting icon so you can get this composer let me add one simple prompt to generate mahesh technicals portfolio website simple portfolio website so let me check how cursor working okay so just send this and let me fast forward the video so it will save our time you can see thinking mode is properly working without any problem and it is generating index.html file without any problem guys okay you can see it is generated a code just click on accept and you can see index.html file is created by ai cloud 3.7 sonnet okay so we, you can also minimize the application so it will run in background without any problem now you can see our css file also created now it is creating javascript file so it is working perfectly fine without any error and without any issue you can use that cursor ai code editor on your android phone so if you want to uninstall just run the script again like this and you have the options here if you want to update you can select update option and you if you want to uninstall you can select uninstall option just type the number which you want to do a task it will do automatically for you this is the script so if you like the script i created that script so please do one like for that script okay so if you like this video so just follow this guide from here okay this is my article if you like that so please share with your friends who want to install cursor ai code editor on their android phone without any problem so thank you so much for watching guys and we will meet in the next video